So pressure is beginning to mount, but there's a lot of preparation going on. The issue for us is the access to protection equipment. We're very keen to have the level that we started at at the beginning of this back in place. Now, we understand the science. We understand why the surgical masks, which is what most frontline staff are, are having to use at the moment, are adequate. But there's a difference between adequate and feeling sure that you're doing the best thing for yourself as a healthcare worker and not running the risk of picking up infection. So wearing the full kit puts your head in a very different place. Mm. You're, you know exactly what you're wearing, you know exactly what protection you've got. People around you know what you're wearing and what protection you've got. And you move around your clinical space in a different way from when you're just wearing the sort of kit that we would wear on a daily basis in normal conditions. So in normal conditions, when you're wearing that kind of kit, where is your head? I mean, are you a less able or a less capable medic? No, you're, you're not cap less capable in any way, but what you're tending to, the kit that we're currently wearing is the kit that we would normally wear if we were doing a suit, we were suturing somebody, stitching somebody up, or we were in with somebody who was vomiting, say. The difference here is that we've got healthcare workers who are part of society. They've got family, they've got old relatives, they've got young children. So they're, they're working in two mind spaces. Mm -hmm. They're working as a member of society who's got all the concerns that the rest of society has, but they're also working as a healthcare worker who, have, who know that they are being exposed. And the problem on the front line is you don't always know who is the person who's got the infection. So we're very keen to get that guidance looked at, make sure that healthcare workers feel they've got the kit that they need to feel safe, secure, and able to come and to that work. presumably means the testing procedures as well, to know if they're carrying the virus or well, if they should... Well, so we, so we know, and I think Catherine puts it really well, and she 